Hey everybody, it's Logic Bomb 82 from the Mature Mighty Gamers group. Today I'm going to show you how to install Steam CMD, which is the easiest platform by far to host your own dedicated servers. And we're going to do this fresh. So what you need to do is Google Steam CMD, whatever your browser of choice is. It'll be this first link right here. Click on that. And we're going to do it for Windows. They do have a Linux client here, but uh, we're on a Windows machine, so we're going to do it there. You want to click that, and then you'll see a link right here. Click on that, hit Save File. And once it gets get, gets itself downloaded, you want to open the folder that it's in. And you'll see it's a zip folder. So what you want to do is right-click on it and hit Extract All. Put this wherever you want your Steam CMD folder to be. I recommend somewhere simple that you can get to easily because you're going to be in and out of it a lot. So I like to put mine directly onto my uh, C drive, or if you have a spare drive, put it on your spare drive, but I don't on this machine. So um, make a new folder. We're going to call it Steam CMD. And then you want to hit OK. And this is going to extract it there. And there you see now it's extracted. And this should be the only file in there if this is the first time you've done this. So you need to actually double click on it. Hit Run. It's going to download some files and fill up this folder for you. That's normal. It could take a little bit depending on your download speed. It's not really a lot, so. There, it's done once you get to the prompt like this. And now you have Steam CMD installed. And I'm going to show you real quick how to do a game, how to download a game. So you need to find the, the game ID, and there's a Steam database. So if you type in Steam DB, it'll take you right here. And here's the database of all the Steam games. So let's say we're going to do Conan Exiles. Oops, Conan's enough. You'll find it from there. And so what you're going to look for here is Conan Exiles Dedicated Server, and it's considered a tool if you see that. And this is the easy way to find things. If you actually delete this out and for app type put in tool, and then hit search, it's going to show you all the dedicated server files um, by the time that they were last updated. So here's like an eco server or don't starve server. This is what we're going to use with the Astroneers. Let's say, for instance, we want to do this eco server. So this app ID number is what you need. So you either need to write it down or copy it and then you pull it back to your Steam CMD window and you need to log in with anonymous first. So type in login space anonymous then hit enter. It's going to connect you. Waiting for user info. There you get another prompt. That means it worked. Now you want to type in app underscore update and then that number or space sorry. So app underscore update space and then whatever server you're trying to install. So if we were doing this eco server here it's 739, whoops, 739590. And so then I'd hit enter, and you'll see now it's starting to update state. And it's pre-allocating pre space for it, and now it's eventually going to download it. It's going to download all the files for Eco. And that's how you can do any server on Steam using Steam CMD. If you have trouble, you go to our website here, which is maturemindedgamers.com. Here's the website. Um, you can see our Discord right here. Click on this Discord and it'll connect you. And then I am LogicBomb82 on there. Feel free to send me a message. I'll try to help you out the best that I can. Also, check out all of our other content. We do podcasts, we do video game reviews, board game reviews. So check us out. Thanks for watching. I hope this helped you. Uh, like I said, if you have any questions, join our Discord and feel free to ask.